Hello, boys and girls. It's Father Gaffney joining you again as we continue to prepare for the sacrament of First Reconciliation, or as we sometimes call it, First Penance or First Confession. Thank you to you and your parents, maybe your grandparents, whoever is helping you to learn about this important sacrament. In lesson one, you learn that we are meant to love God and love our neighbor. In lesson two, you learned about the Ten Commandments, the laws given to Moses by God, about how following these laws, these commandments, helps us to do the right thing, to follow God's way. Well, now we come to lesson three. In lesson three, we are told that we can act like Jesus. And as we listen to how Jesus interacted with others, as we hear how he interacted in the gospel, in the stories we read in the four gospels, we come to know more about his way. Jesus loved everyone, and he asks us to love everyone also. Well, what about those people who are mean to us? Well, yes, Jesus says we should forgive those who hurt us. Well, what about those people who make me really angry? Jesus tells us to make up with someone when you fight with them or argue with them. What about getting even? Jesus says, treat others the same way you want them to treat you. The last page of your lesson has some really good questions for us to think about as we examine our conscience. It asks, do I act like Jesus? Take a look at those questions, boys and girls. Give those some good thought. No matter what our age, we are all trying to act like Jesus. He gives us the very best example. It's one of love and it's one of forgiveness. Let's continue to learn his way, his way of speaking, his way of acting. Boys and girls, thank you for spending time on lesson three as you are preparing for first reconciliation. Let's finish by praying the act of contrition together. My God, I am sorry for my sins with all my heart. In choosing to do wrong and in failing to do good, I have sinned against you, whom I should love above all things. I firmly intend, with your help, to do penance, to sin no more, and to avoid whatever leads me to sin. Our Savior, Jesus Christ, suffered and died for us. In his name, my God, have mercy. Amen.